Harper, what'd you think? Oh, yeah, uh, the start, it was, uh, I, I thought uh, Jamal was gonna, Jamil was going to come out and be more assertive in the first couple of rounds just to get a fill out. But early on, it was obvious that, you know, it seems like he, he, he was in survival mode. You feel me? I don't think he really pushed for the victory. I don't mm. think he was really in there to win. I mean, why do you say that? It, it seems like he was just like the the outcome of the fight. It seemed like it was a foregone conclusion after about five, six rounds. It didn't look like, like I said, Charlo was in there to win the fight. You know, he really wasn't exerting, exerting himself. And um, he was holding a lot. I, I didn't really see him sitting in the, I didn't see him in there looking as if he was trying to win the fight. I know he has more ability. He has more skills than what he showed tonight. And a lot of times that power, you know, you just know that, hey, I don't want to get hit with that shit. And I'm not going to get knocked out. And you heard him at the post-fight interview. He said, hey, you, you didn't knock me out. So he found some type of solace in not getting knocked out tonight. Um, but uh, the victory was a, fore, a foregone conclusion. It was obvious that, you know, I think if he would have mixed it up, fought, he probably would have gave himself a better chance. But he also would have gave Canelo a better chance to catch, so, to catch him. I just didn't think he, he wanted to get hurt. He didn't want to get hurt even after the knockdown. Seemed like he just fought in retreat. If, yeah, he fought in retreat instead of fighting to really win the fight. That's what I thought. What's your message to Jamal? Uh, he's going back down in weight. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's a huge fight for him. Yeah, it's a big fight here. You know, if, but Crawford want Canelo. Okay, that's true. You see? Yeah. Crawford want Canelo. But um, just get back to the drawing board. You feel me? Moving up like Bavol when, he, uh, when Canelo fought Bavol. It wasn't a smart move, and this wasn't a smart move. What do you think about Canelo's performance? Um, Canelo looked as if he tried to press the fight, but you know, uh, uh, J Jamal wasn't giving him nothing. Mm. Jamal go? wasn't giving him nothing. So, where does Canelo go from here? Oh, he's uh, he can fight whoever he want to fight. You know, Crawford. But, Who would you, you know, like to see him fight? I think that Crawford fight is enticing. It's a huge fight, right? it's a huge fight man. Uh, two of the best, two best pound for pound fighters in the game. You feel me? We had undisputed, undisputed. Now we can have pound for pound, pound for pound. All right, thank you, <laughs> All right, we'll talk God. about Tarvis' take before I let you go. That's Tarvis' take. I just gave it to you. Okay. All right, my All right. God. Thank you. Appreciate Great. it.